Good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Hello. Hi, teacher. Hi, good evening. How are you? Con mucha lluvia y trueno. Relajado. Raining. Really? <laughs> sí, pero oh, bueno, estamos bien. Gracias a Dios en casita. Thank God. Thank God. Yes. Hello, hello. I see. Gracias. Say hello on the chat. Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Fine. Thank you. Fine. Nice. <clears throat> All right. Everybody, right on the chat, say something. Say good evening. Say hello. Say it's raining. Say it's not raining. Say you're tired. You're not tired. You're happy. You're fine. You're hungry. All right. Yeah, I see two more messages. Let me check. Let me check. Yeah, from Gracia, from Ricardo. Yeah, I just said hi, good evening, Ricardo. Good evening, everybody. Nice. Okay. More chat messages, please. Oh, yes, yeah, Stephanie, how was your day? It was good, thank you. Busy, but productive. Yeah, very busy. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Nelson says, hi, good evening. Joanna, hello. And the rain. It's raining. Okay. Yeah, it's not raining actually here. No rain this day in San Salvador, at least in the place where I am. Mm -hmm. Hi, hi, Carla. Good evening. Good evening, good evening. Hi, hi, Wilmer. Good evening. Very good, very good. Nice. You can also use your reaction so you can say good evening. Okay, very good. Well, guess what? <laughs> guess what? We continue practicing the WH questions, the WH words. Okay, <clears throat> let's see. Yesterday was our session number 11. And today we have our session number 12. Let me just edit something right here really quick. Oh my God. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Wait a minute. Um, today is September. September what? Monday, Tuesday. Hi. Hi. Oh, uh, today is Tuesday. September. Uh huh. Tuesday, September. Hi. The fifth. Oh, the fifth. Yeah. Yes. Thanks. <laughs> it's all right. Thank you. Great. Finally, yeah. right? Today is September fifth. Yeah, and next week is Independence Day. Yeah. Uh -huh. Commemorating Independence 200 and something, right? 200 and something years of independence. Yes, true. Okay. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Miguel. How are you? Later. <laughs> but, good. but fine okay nice Mr. Ramirez where are you from I'm from El Salvador well where, where I'm from San Miguel San Miguel yes but now I live in San Salvador in San Salvador where exactly the street motocross oh nice Mira el Valle, it's near here. Where is it? It's near here. I am near Universidad El Salvador. 
Oh, Mm -hmm. yes, you're going to the volcano, right? yes, What yes, across the street. It's a beautiful place, actually. yes, yes, Mm -hmm. have a Nice view. yes, have a A nice nice view view. and the clima, The weather. the weather is very good, It's very cool. cool, <laughs> yes, <laughs> and that's more. that's really, really rare to find in San Salvador because most of the places are really hot. You know, everybody Yes. has air conditioners because the weather is terrible. But on that place, like going to the volcano is really nice. Yes. 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 In in my house in San Miguel, uh, I live in <laughs> uh, follow the volcano Chaparrastique. really Yeah. so you are near the two volcanoes San Salvador Yeah. and San Yeah. Miguel volcano <laughs> oh, yes. what a coincidence Yes, yes. so in The San Miguel weather. it's not very hot either No, no. The weather is is cool. mm. it's cool too that's great That's a blessing. <laughs> Hi. So, Mr. Hector says, good evening. Right now, I'm driving and I can activate. Oh, nice. No problem. Be careful. Yeah. It's raining and he's driving. Yes, that's in La Unión, I think, Mr. Mr. Manuel Ramirez. We have two Mr. Ramirez, Mr. Miguel and Mr. Manuel Ramirez, okay? <laughs> somebody from La Unión and somebody from San Miguel. We don't have anybody from Los Planes, no? Los Planes is also beautiful because you have a beautiful view of the city. All right. As I was mentioning, we are having our session number 12 and just today, See you in a minute. Uh huh. So we continue practicing how to use the simple information questions. Actually, simple present information questions or information questions and simple present. Because, like, where do you live? What do you do? When do you have meetings? So these questions are. Information questions, but in simple phrase, okay? So that is practically what we continue studying, what we continue practicing. And at the end of the session, you'll be able to use simple present information questions, okay? So before anything else happens, yeah, we have to have the attendance first. First things first. Bam, 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 bam. Wait a minute. I need to find the correct date. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. The 5th of September. Anna, Christina? Present teacher. Hello. Hello. Andrea? Alguien sabe algo que le haya pasado a Andrea? Yesterday she was not in class either. I think there was a sick. She's still sick. Oh yeah. I think. Yeah, No, somebody. no, no. She's fine. Just the uh, weather. I think. Just the weather. Yeah, I think. Oh, She's fine. thank God. There's somebody from my work is sick. Yeah, she just went yesterday right in the morning and then the doctor. She have she have problem with the transportation. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, moving around the city afterwards sometimes can be a pain. I Yes, know. but she's fine. Oh, thank God. Thank you. All right, we got Brian. Yes. Hi, Brian. Hi. All right, Christian. Christian, Christian. Christian actually usually names himself Andrea is as present now. hi as Alexander. <laughs> Andrea. Hello, teacher. Hey, how are you?
Okay. Are you okay? Well, hopefully she's fine. Okay, so Christian Alexander. David Miguel Angel. Present teacher. You prefer David Escobar. Yes. And that sounds great, actually. David Escobar. Doris. Doris, Doris. Not connected yet, Doris. Douglas. Douglas. Present. Hey, hey. No problem. Let's see. Stephanie. Present. Hi. Yeah. Let's see. Francisco Javier. Present. Good evening. Hello. Teacher. Good evening. Gracias. Present. Hi. Hi. Did you work close or near your house today? Yes. In mm -hmm. a big camp. In a big out again. Nice. So Mr. Hector is driving, but he already reported himself. Joanna. Present. Hi. Good evening. And the chat mentioned. Hector, sí. ahorita. Uh -huh, sí. Thank you. Jose Antonio. Jose. No. Okay. Carla. Present teacher. Hi, good evening. Laura. Hi. Laura, Laura. We don't have Laura. Miguel Angel. Present teacher. Hi, good evening. Good evening. Nelson. Present teacher. Hi, good evening. Good evening. Okay, Ricardo. Present, present teacher. Hi, good evening. Good evening. Wendy. Present okay. teacher. Hi, good evening. Wilmer. Present teacher. Hi, good evening. Good evening. Okay, well, nice. Welcome, everybody. Let me just choose something from right here. I got something. Okay, here we go. Okay, asking and talking about, yes, no questions. Let me just have this wheel, the spinning wheel right here. One second, please. Okay, I'm going to be choosing names, and you're also going to be helping me out, choose names for this questions. Let's see, we're going to start with Wilmer. Are you ready, Wilmer? No, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, you see? <laughs> Free pass. Relax. <laughs> You're lucky today. Maybe you can buy the lottery. <laughs> okay, we go with the unknown name. Okay, Wilmer, choose a uh, name. Yeah. Um, yeah. Douglas. Douglas, all right. Okay, so Douglas will be asked the question. Oh, what is something you don't do in the afternoon? Um, I don't do it. I don't do. Okay, no hago la tarde. I don't exercise. I don't drink coffee. 
I don't I... drink coffee. <laughs> you don't drink coffee in the afternoon? <laughs> no. Okay. I don't play sports. Uh -huh. Nice. All right. So you choose the next one, Douglas. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, Ricardo. All right, Ricardo goes next. What do you do in the morning? Hello, hello. Hello. What do you do in the morning? I get up. I eat my breakfast. I go to the work. I drink coffee. <laughs> I do many things in the morning, mm -hmm. right? Uh -huh. And I work. And I work. And I work. Okay. I get up. I take a shower. <laughs> I have breakfast. I go to work. Uh -huh. I take I... my lunch. At noon. <laughs> At noon, correct. <laughs> uh -huh. All right. So, Ricardo, you choose the next one. Um, I'm to share that I'm going to the names of some of them. Let's see. What list are you? Douglas fue el que me mencionó, ¿verdad? Right. Ah, okay, no, no, no. Uh, uh, la compañera Gracia. Gracia. No se vale el reprise. Ajá, ni el revenge. <laughs> Thanks, Ricardo. Ok. And what is something that you don't do in the morning, Gracia? I don't sleep. <laughs> I don't sleep. I don't sleep as I want, as I wish. Okay. Yes. <laughs> I don't sleep late. Okay, gracias. You choose the next one. David. David. All right, David. Ah, do you stay up late? Why or why not? Stay up late is quedarse despierto hasta tarde. Stay up late. Your hand, David. Yes. Confess. <laughs> Do yes. you stay up late? Why or why not? Yes. Uh, why? Because play video games. <gasps> You stayed up late because it. you play video games. Yes. And you play video games in English? I'm sorry? Do you play the video games in English? No, in Spanish. <laughs> change. Change the video I games like the boys I like to play video games in English. Uh -huh. It's too very, 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 very difficult. <laughs> but it's better for you to learn vocabulary in English. Yes, yes. Uh -huh. It helps. I yes. know people that have learned English just by playing games. That's a good idea. All right, David, the next one. Yes, the next one is... Mm -hmm. Preparing them. Get ready. Francisco. Francisco. All right. Francisco. Do you have classes in the afternoon? Right. Frank is in answer. Not, I don't. You don't. You only work in the afternoon. All right. Francisco, who's next? Next. Say a name. Hola, hola. A name. Mucha. Yes, say a name. Porque tengo problema con la señal. No problems. Elija alguien más. Eh, Stephanie. Stephanie. 
Thank you. Aha. Hi. Hi. How do you study English? Often. Often, often. Often. Frequency. How often do you Every study? day with my boyfriend. Because he speaks English, full English. All right. So you what? study every day. Nice. Yes. So I study English every day with my boyfriend. All right. Because he speaks English. Yeah. Right. Uh, it's difficult to because the English of he is very perfect. <laughs> so <laughs> because, yes, he, because, because sometimes he only speaks. Yes, yeah. Sometimes I need um translate please, <laughs> again. <laughs> okay, so he is only speaking, he's not teaching. <laughs> yes, yes, uh, yes, yeah. Maybe he needs to develop more patience. <laughs> All right. Oh, so with my daughters, I I I study English. Yes. How old are your practice. daughters? Uh, uh, eight years a half. All right. So they are in second or third grade already. Yes, second grade. Second grade. All right. Yeah. That's great. When I take the I question I. Uh, how are you? Uh, mm -hmm. What day is today? <laughs> nice. That's good. That's basic. Right. basic questions. But that's yes. good. You practice with them. All right. You say another name, please. Um, okay. Vamos con, quiero ver, participantes. Muchos hombres. Vamos ahora con... Cristina. Christina, all right, Christy. Your question. <gasps> oh! <laughs> good luck. Yes, good luck. What a coincidence. Okay, Christy. Say Hola. a name. Say a name. Eh, quiero ver. Alguien más. No, no, no. <laughs> Eh, no sé si ya pasó Wendy no, Wendy are you ready? ready all right, here we go what do you do in the afternoon? Mm -hmm. I do work I work Okay. I work. I only work. And what do you do at work in the afternoon? I send emails. I write reports. I have meetings. What do you do? I work and and I review the reports. Mm -hmm. I supervise the accounting only. All right, nice. Excellent. Okay, next, Wendy. Veamos que... Permítame. Brian. Brian. <laughs> Brian, Brian. All right, what do you do in the evening? Um, in the evening. Besides so, taking classes. <laughs> so, uh, well, I I prefer uh playing video games and chat with my with my friends. Uh, eating a lot and <laughs> and listen my. My beautiful teacher. Ah. For five ah. points. Ah. 
All right. So in the evening, I usually uh -huh, chat with my friends, have dinner. Okay, great. All right. Who do you nominate, Brian? Laura. Laura. You wanted this opportunity just to nominate Laura. Yep. <laughs> Okay. Laura? Ahorita acaba de hacer la envidia, Brian, con, la, con los noodles. <laughs> Laura, are you here? Can you answer? I'm trying to find Laura. Creo que Laura tiene problemas de conexión. Porque hoy uh -huh. creo que se estaba conectando desde el teléfono. Really? Oh. Ahí está. She's getting connected. Connecting to audio, dice. Vamos a esperar. Waiting for Laura. Waiting for love. <laughs> Hey, Laura, can you listen to us? Me agarra el micrófono. What happened? I see her, but I don't listen to her. Maybe you can answer through the chat as well. Like, what is something you don't do at night? I don't go running. I don't cook. I don't send emails. What is something you don't do at night? All right. I see. Oh, connection. All right. Nice. No problem. <laughs> okay. It's all right. Okay, next one after Laura. We can nominate somebody else. Joanna, do you participate already? Um, lo que no haría en la noche es um, I don't not eat sweet, como no como dulces. I don't eat sweets, I don't eat desserts, <laughs> porque no duerme. Por lo mismo dulce, por lo mismo dulce. Ahí tú has acelerado una. Really? Mm -hmm. Ay, no quisiera que me funcionaran esas cosas a mí. <laughs> Tampoco um, es el drink the coffee. Porque... I don't drink coffee. Oh, wow, nice. Vaya, ya va. Next, díganos a alguien más. Somebody else. Carla. ¿Who? Carla. Carla. Uh -huh. All right. What time do you wake up? Uh -huh. Carla, what time do you wake up? Wake up, wake up. Sorry, pero... Creí que se me había ido la señal, es conmigo, va. Sí, what time do you wake up? esperando. Vaya. What time do you wake up? I wake up. Wake me up. ¿A qué hora se despierta? ¿Verdad que qué? ¿A qué hora se despierta? Yes, wake up. I sleep at seven o'clock. A.M. A.M. You wake up at seven a.m. Sí, es que aquí mismo en Armenia trabajo y el trabajo me queda como a diez minutos. Qué bendición. Sí, mire, what a blessing. Sí, sí por eso. Working? What time do you start Perdón? working? What time do you start working? 
¿A qué horas empieza su trabajo? Entro al trabajo. Ah, abrimos a las a las nueve. At nine. Uh -huh. Oh, wow. Trabajo en un banco. Sí, definitely. Enjoy. <ríe> sí. Enjoy. Sí. 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 Long, long time. Yo entraba a las nueve. No entraba a las nueve, pero a las nueve ya empezaba a trabajar. So, I have to be at 8.40, 8.45. Pero imagine that was really late for me. Because now I have to be there before seven. Sí, Ajá, nosotros abrimos a... <ríe> nosotros abrimos a las nueve. Yeah. Pero right. tenemos que estar ahí como a las ocho, ocho y media, uh -huh. más o menos. All right, who's next? Quiero ver. No sé si ya pasó José Antonio. No. Ok, José Antonio, entonces. Ajá, Jose. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. What do you do um, on the weekends? Okay, on the weekend, I go to the charm. Uh, I go to the bar. Um, I, I play with my, my song. Mm -hmm. In my daughter. Mm -hmm. mm. That's nice. Yes. Yes, you do very interesting activities on the weekend. And the last person? Richard. 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 <laughs> Richard already participated? No? On the weekend again. So this one is definitely the last one. Oh! <laughs> what time do you go to sleep? Uh, Volunteers. Uh, <laughs> okay. Any volunteer? Okay. What time do you go to sleep? I go to sleep at? Me, okay, right. I answer. Okay. Uh, I go to sleep at 11 p.m. o'clock. All right, 11, 11 p.m. Trato, trato. Try, <laughs> I try. Uh, but... <laughs> okay. Some day, 12, 12. Midnight. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes, I know it's difficult to to finish all the activities <laughs> sometimes. Okay, no problem. Okay. That was just part of, you know, practicing WH questions for usual habits or daily activities that we do. All right. Okay, let me see. I'm going to, yes, I'm going to share this one with the manual this time so that you can see where we are. Yes, we're right here because this is the, practically the introduction of this unit, unit three that we just started yesterday. And we talk a lot, we practice a lot how to make wh questions right so something very important you have to keep in mind is the let's say the formula the structure okay with the wh word auxiliary subject verb and complement okay if you know that if you remember that order you structure the questions correctly in english Okay, and that is not only for the simple present, that counts for all the tenses. That's the correct word order for structuring WH questions in present, in past, in future, in any tense in English. That's something very, let's say, very 
easy, very favorable from English because once you learn the pattern, that works for all the other tenses, okay? For example, if you say, where do you work? And you want to say that in past, where did you work? And you only change the auxiliary, but the order is the same. Well, if you want to say that in future, you only change do for will, where will you work next year, right? So you see, it's practically the same, only change the auxiliary. So the auxiliary will determine the tense if it is a simple present, if it is a simple past, if it is a simple future, or if it is in any other tense. All right. So as we practiced yesterday with all these questions, and we were also talking about the departments in which you work. Okay, so now I can describe do this. I perform in my department. Some of the questions were are what, when, where, why, who. And now we got to this part. Ask questions about someone else's duties at the workplace, someone else's duties, someone else's responsibilities at the workplace. So you ask some classmates about the duties they have to perform in the workplace and share. So we have to start this conversation. Listen to the teacher read the conversation, then practice with the partner, Kevin and Albert. What do you have to do on Thursday? Have to. It's a responsibility, an obligation, right? You say, oh, I have to buy the medicine. I have to work. I have to complete. I have to finish this report. So I have to. It's my responsibility to do it, right? It's your duty. So that's why we use have to. It's very similar to Spanish. Tengo que. Tengo que hacer algo, right? So what do you have to do on Thursday? I just check the production for the new product and write a report about it. Why? Because I need someone to help me move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Sure. What is it about? What does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? I'm not sure. What time does he finish to work on Thursday? Oh, when does he have free time? Okay. So it has, let's say, a couple of WH questions, I mean WH questions, but I also want you to try to see how to use have to, right? Because it's something that is your responsibility, something that is kind of your obligation, right? So what do you have to do on Thursday? I just checked the productions for the new product and write a report about it. Why? Because I need someone to help me move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Sure. What is it about? What does Mr. Ruiz, Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? Mm, I'm not sure. What time does he finish to work on Thursday? Or when does he have free time? All right. Check the conversation, see if you have any question regarding vocabulary or pronunciation so we can discuss first, okay? Check it out. Try to read all the conversation on your own. Ready? Ready to practice? Yes. Oh, good. Yes. All right. Yes. Of course, full of energy. Let me see. One, two, three. Okay, I guess this is the right number. Help your partner in case they need some assistance, okay, with pronunciation mainly or with vocabulary or clarifying or making similar examples. Probably you can change your information, substitute, right?
Creo que sí, no sé si la, si alguien la puede compartir. Oh, yo no la puedo compartir porque tengo el WhatsApp todo habilitado desde la laptop. Pero me quiero ver si la puedo descargar. A ver. Y estoy conectada a la clase de, del celular. Bueno, creo que ya, ya la subo para que la tengamos. En el chat. Y... Oro. Ok. Este, comprenderla en español. ¿Verdad que en la parte en la parte donde dice? Vamos a ver. Lo primero es ¿Qué haces los jueves, eh, verdad? Es... O martes. No, jueves, eh, perdón. Sí, jueves. Tuesday. Sí, jueves. Jueves, después dice, eh, yo voy a chequear la producción para el nuevo producto y escribir un reporte acerca de eso. ¿Por qué, verdad? Uh -huh. Porque sí. necesito alguien que alguien que me, ayude. que me ayude a mover unas cajas, ¿verdad? Que boxes es caja. Sí. Ajá, can you do me a favor? Ajá, puedes hacerme un favor. Por supuesto, este, este, ¿de qué se trata? Sí. Esta parte que no sé qué. What does Mr. Ruiz have to do? ¿Qué era o qué hace el señor Ruiz ese día? Oh, ajá. Okay. No estoy muy seguro lo otro, ¿verdad? Sí. ¿A qué horas finaliza el trabajo el jueves? El jueves. O, o cuando tiene día libre. Cuando tiene día libre. Ah, okay. Tiempo libre, sí. sí. Este, lo, los otros compañeros, ¿quiénes son? Um, to help. Oh, wow. uh -huh. uh, so, to help. Mi mom son boxes. Can you do me a favor? Favor. Favor. Uh, favor. Sure. What is about? What does Mr. Ruiz how to do that day? I'm not sure. What time does he finish to work on Saturday? Or when does he have free time? Good, good. Excellent. Okay, let's see. Turn out the thumb. Right, right? Ah. Yo, 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 con quien? Okay. Uh, because I need, because I need someone to help, to help me. Uh, move some boxes. Can you do? Uy, espérate que no leo. Can you do me a favor? Sure. What is What is it about? What does Mr. Reese have to do that day? I'm not so sure. What time does? Hey, bitch, I need a lente for the paja. What time? What time does he finish the work on Thursday? Or when does he have free time? Vaya, hoy podemos cambiar. No. Yo sería Kevin, ¿verdad? Sí. What do you have to do on Thursday? I just checked the production for the new product in why I report about it. Why? Because I need some, some to help me move some boxer. Can you do me a, a favor? Sure. What is about? What does Mr. Reese have to do that day? I'm not so sure. 
what I do is finish to work on Thursday. Or when do he have free time? Vaya, ahora podemos traducir el vocabulario con alguna palabra. ¿Verdad que lo primero que le pregunta es qué, ha, qué haces tú el jueves o viernes? No. Thursday. Eh. Martes. Martes. ¿Qué tienes que hacer el martes? Le creo que es. Tengo que revisar el, un reporte, le dice. La Ajá. Tengo que revisar no. el nuevo reporte de la producción y escribir un reporte de ellos. No. ¿Por qué le pregunto? Porque necesito, al, necesito que me ayude a mover algunas cajas. ¿no? Caja. Puedes hacerme por favor, ¿no? Puedes hacerme el favor, claro. Bueno, ¿Qué decir esto? Es claro. ¿Qué, qué tiene que hacer el señor Ruiz? Ah, que sí, así de allá que se lo Sí. ¿Qué sí, es about? Ok, continue. Come on, David. Sure, what is it about? Uh, what does Mr. Reese have to do that day? I am not too sure. What time does he finish to work on Thursday? Or when does he have free time? Excellent. Yeah. He needs to work on Thursday or when does he have free time? Ahora al revés, Ricardo. Órale. Mire, si, si, si grito mucho, comprenda, compañeros, que aquí en la casa hay un tincalón y como que es un gran diluvio, ¿verdad? aunque estén cayendo las <ríe> dos minguitas. Por eso grito a veces, lo siento. Dale. Vaya, yo soy Kevin hoy, ¿verdad? Sí, sí. What do you have to do on Thursday? I use check the production for the new product and write a report about it. What? I don't have idea. So let me check. What do you have to do on Thursday? I just check the production for the new product and write a report about, about it. Why? Because, oh because I need someone. 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 Ah, mm -hmm. someone. Because I need someone to help me move some boxes. Si quieres practicar un diálogo, de todas maneras la compañía. Vaya. La pronunciación. What, what do you do? What do you what do you have to do on Thursday? 
I have checked the the production for the mm -hmm. new product and write a report about it. Why? Voy a la de cuando dice allí dice I just I just I just just I just I just I just I just check the report the production I just check the production for the new product in Ryan Ryan report about it about it about it about it about it why 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 because I need someone to tell me move some boxes can you do me a favor sure what is about What does Mr. Reese have to do that day? I'm not too sure. <clears throat> what time does he finish to work on Tuesday? Or when does he have free time? Ay, ahora creo que mm. empiezo yo. Sí. What do you, what do you have to do on the Thursday? In Thursday. I just mm. checked the production for the new product in Raya report about it. Why? Because I need somewhere to help me move some boxes can can mm. you do me a favor 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 mm. favor favor sure what is about mm. what does mr Ruiz have to do they to do they that day, I'm not so sure. What time mm. does the he finish to work on Thursday, or when does he have mm. free time? Okay, yeah. Mm. Sí, es que ya viene la tormenta. Yo igual, yo así ya comienzo. Me voy a tener que desconectar. Por... All right, everybody's back. Yes. Yeah, yes. I see nobody in the rooms anymore. I come okay. back. Nice. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. <laughs> okay, great. So, how did it go? No problems with the conversation? Easy peasy? Easy. Yes. Nice. Well, let me see. Just have a couple of participations. 
in the general meeting, we're gonna listen to from group number one, we got David and Stefan. Ready? Are you okay. ready? David? Yes. Okay. David, David. I Come on, David. David. But I don't listen to David. <laughs> Ready? Oh, maybe somebody else from the first group. Um, Christine and Hector. Oh, yes, true. It's raining mm -hmm. here already. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Who can help Stephanie reading the conversation? Christine? David or Hector? Anyone available? Hey, Mom. Okay, okay. Yeah, Hector is going to help you. <laughs> Lights, cameras, action. Hey. Okay. What do you have to do on your day? I just checked the production for the new product and write a report about it. Why? Because I need someone to help me move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Sure. What it's about? What does Mr. Rich have to do that day? Mm, I'm not so sure. What time does he finish to work on Tuesday? On when does? He have free time. Ooh, great. Okay. Ooh. Awesome. Finish. Favor, favor, right? Next group we have Douglas, Francisco, Joanna, and Ricardo. Who is available? This is my team. Hi, David. Let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> Solo to uh -huh. shoot the map, uh -huh. please. <laughs> Otra vez. Otra go, vez. go, team. <laughs> no, no. All right. We got Douglas, Ricardo are, are, and are you ready? Okay. Go. Yes. Start. You, I, am, I am Kevin. Okay. What do you have to do on Thursday? I just check the production for the new product. Um, write a report about it. Why? Because I need someone to help me move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Sure. What about it? What is about it? <laughs> what does Mr. Reef have to do that day? I'm not sure. What time does he finish to work on Thursday? Or when does he have free time? I don't know. <laughs> finish. Excellent. Yes. Give me just one Thank second. You. Just need to close a door and a window because it's pretty noisy outside. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. All right. From the next group, let's see. I already closed the door. <laughs> we got 
Nelson and Wilmer. Are you ready? Okay. Nelson? Yes. Go. Action. Okay. What do you have to do on Thursday? I just check the production for the new product and write report about it. Why? Because I need someone to help me move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Can do you do me a favor? Sure. What is what? What it is it about? What does Mr. Ruiz have to do what day? I'm not so sure. What time does uh, he finish to work on Thursday? Or when does he have free time? Reaction. Veo todos los claps que le hacen de reaction. <laughs> oh my God. Nice. And the next group was Brian and Wendy. Me and Wendy. Yes. Uh, okay. Wendy. I'm Kevin. Are you able to? <laughs> I'm ready. Okay. Action. What do you do? What? Sorry, sorry. What? Pero me fuera no voy a voltear que no leo bien. Rewind. What do you have to do? Why, why, what do you have to do on Thursday? I just check the production for the new product and write a report about it. About it, why? Because I need to someone to help. Because I need someone to help me uh, move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Sure. What is about? What does Mr. Ru Mr. Reese have to what to do that day? I'm not, I'm not so sure. What time does he finish to work on Thursday? Or when does have to do free time? Bye. All right, if you listen, we are because of the rain. It's raining so heavily. It's a heavy rain. Nice. No. Right. Oh, but that's so good. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's not so good when the electricity goes up. <laughs> it's no, not so no. Good. I, I, I talk with, with, with the exercise. Ah, about the exercise, about the conversation. Excellent. Congratulations. It was great. Sí. Es que, es que Gracia nos enseñó. <laughs> <laughs> Brian is in the in the cheerful, charming mood today. He has many moods. All right. Now you have some exercises. Read the conversation again and circle the correct word in bolts. In bolts means in negrita, okay? So Read the conversation again and circle the correct word in bold. Then answer the question. So you have to answer this question about the conversation, right? Do it on your own, and then we're gonna compare. Traten de hacerlo de forma individual, y después lo vamos a comparar. Then we compare with somebody. Okay? You have three minutes from now on.
Ai. Se fue la luz, dicha, en mi casa. Really? Pero ya vino. Ah, ya me, vino. Me... Ajá, es que se me cortó cuando se pasaron los datos y otra vez, y estaban todos congelados. Y no escucho que hablen. <risa> Están trabajando en el ejercicio. Sí, sí, eso estoy haciendo. Ah, vaya, completando. Tenía okay. tres minutos para completar esto. Ah, ok, ok, ok. Gracias. One more minute, yes. Solo me acordé de... Y es así como morí, pero reviví. Venga, de aquí no se ha ido, porque si no ya estuviéramos en problemas. Aquí está completely dark, que se va la luz. All right, now everybody finished, right? Yes or yes? Number one, what do or what does? What does? What does? What does? Hola, what? teacher, me volví a conectar, lo siento. <laughs> Presente. <laughs> Present. <laughs> Espérenme que por alguna razón no me deja hacer el círculo aquí. What does Albert have to do on Thursday? Vamos a hacer primero las correct words y luego vamos a responder. Number two. Why do or why does Kevin need help? Does because he's a uh, third, third person word. too. Exactly. Yes. Why, does Ke why does Kevin need help? Who do or who does you think is going to help Kevin? Do. do do because the subject is you. Who do you think is going to help Kevin? What do or what does Mr. Ruiz do on Thursday? What does does Mr. Ruiz? I think it sounds easier if you read Ruiz in Spanish directly rather than reading it in English. Sounds very forced. So, what does Albert have to do on Thursday? Uh -huh. ¿Qué es lo que tiene que hacer Albert on Thursday? He has... Check. Check, check the, the production. production. He has to check the production. And report. And write report. Uh -huh. And he has to write report. report. About the product. 
<laughs> yes. Yo le puse todo, ajá, algo así. The product. Yo le puse, teacher, Albert checks the production for the new product and writes a report about it. That's okay. Equal, equal, But if, equal. You, if you say he has to, como es una responsabilidad, es algo que tiene que hacer ese día. Podría ah, ser okay. Yes. No problem. Lo vamos a dejar aquí arriba because the space de abajo is too short. Okay. Why does Kevin need help? Because? Because he needs some, some boxes. He needs, puede ser una opción, he needs to. Or he has to move some boxes. Aquí va a depender de qué grado de urgencia ustedes le quieran dar. Él tiene que hacer eso o él necesita hacer eso, right? So he needs to move or he has to move some boxes. It's his responsibility to move those boxes, right? Okay, who do you think is going to help Kevin? I think <laughs> uh -huh. Mr. Ruiz. Mr. Ruiz. Y el pobre el señor Ruiz le van a echar el pato. I think oh, Mr. Ruiz <laughs> is going to help Kevin. Él ha de ser el señor asistente y por eso está diciendo, ah, ¿cuándo me puede prestar el señor Ruiz? Okay, I think Mr. Ruiz is going <laughs> To help Kevin. The Kevin, hombre, que no puede mover esas cosas de nada. Just kidding. Ha de ser que tienen que ir a la warehouse y todo eso. Como ya me imagino, si a mí me tocara mover un montón de boxes, yo no podría, tendría que buscar help. Yes. Máximo si hay que subirla a esos, est a esos estantes tan altos. Ok. What does Mr. Ruiz, Ruiz do on Thursday? <laughs> Albert not know it. <clears throat> Albert is not sure. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Albert <laughs> is not sure. Or, sorry, sorry. Or he doesn't know. Que no sabe. No sabe el itinerary o las actividades que el señor Ruiz, el Mr. Ruiz. Ok. Good. ¿Alguien tiene algo diferente o le quedó de alguna otra forma? O any other suggestion, any other alternative? No. Sure. Hello. Clear. Clear all drawings. But give me one second, please. Teacher. Yes. Una consulta. ¿Por qué le colocamos este al NIT de necesito una S? Como el Porque era he. Como es tercera persona, he needs. Pero si fuera que yo necesito, I need to. Ah. I need to go, I need to complete, I need to finish. Ahí no hay problema. I, you, we, they. No pasa nada con el verbo. Pero si la, el sujeto de la oración es he, she, it, ahí sí necesito la S. He no. needs. De hecho, okay. si hubiera sido, él tiene que, tendría que ser, he has to, he has to complete, he has to finish. Ok, yes? gracias. No, sí, sí. Bye. Wait a minute. Clear like your phone. Bye. One second, one second. Escriban en el chat ahorita. Les voy a dar chance para que primero si quieren las, las hagan en su cuaderno, en su macho. The first draft. Cosas que ustedes tienen que hacer 
algún día de la semana. Por ejemplo, I have to send an email or I have to send emails on Mondays. O sea, para mí es obligation enviar todos los emails on Monday. Sobre todo on Monday, right? I have to organize a meeting on Friday. I have to send the grades, las notas, because I'm a teacher, I have to send the grades reports on Tuesday. I have to send the lesson plan on Thursday. I'm giving examples from my area, pero ustedes pues tienen diferentes responsabilidades. Entonces, al menos, una responsabilidad por cada día de la semana. I have to attend a meeting on Tuesday, on Wednesday, no sé. Primero escriban en su correo y luego las pueden digitar en el chat. ¿Cuánto les doy? Five minutes. Porque solo son five days. Si tienen questions, pues igual las pueden hacer. You can ask questions. I have to listen. I have to visit, sorry, a, a customer or a client oh. on Saturday. I have to check reports. My dog is just crazy when it's raining. <laughs> Sorry, that was a, a commercial. Okay, five minutes.
All right, everybody finished. I see. Let's yes. start. Wait a second. Christy says, I have to make daily reports. David says, I have to send a report to my manager every day. Jesus. <laughs> Andrea, I have to help my siblings with their homework. I have to meet during the week with the thesis advisor. From Monday to Friday, I have I have English class. I have to be in English class. I have to take English classes. Wilmer says, I have to make a lecture boards. Joanna, I have to review the accounting every morning. Oh my God, Wendy, I have to check emails. I have to review reports. I have to supervise the accounting. I have to do financial statements. I have to meet once a week. So you have to have a meeting once a week. Joanna, I have to check incomes every day. Douglas, I have to run every day for six kil oh, 6.5 kilometers at 5 a.m. It's long. I have to take my daughters to school at 7 a.m. I have to go to work at 8. I have to check my, uh, I have to take my lunch at noon. I have to drink coffee every morning. Hector, I have to go running every afternoon after work. Ricardo, I have to check and answer emails every day at work. I have to do exercise even, or at least twice a week. I have to be in classes at 8 o'clock. I have to be, I have to bath my dog I have to yeah on Sundays I have to watch soccer games ah you like to do that probably it's not a responsibility to watch soccer matches <laughs> Carla I have to file clients styles files on Mondays I have to open accounts for employees on Tuesdays I have to call clients on Wednesdays to schedule I have to schedule appointments I have to review my goals on Thursday I have to meet with my boss on Fridays to review my goals. <laughs> that sounds a little bit challenging. Laura, I have to make accounting records. I have to see master tutorial classes every day. I have to be in class at night. I have to exercise in the morning. I have to check my emails in the morning, in the afternoon. Oh, no problem. It's okay, Ricardo. All right, everybody participated? I see. Good, 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 good. Any question? Sure, no questions? Okay. The rain stops already. Oh, some more comments. Amazing. <laughs> nice. All right. On the first lesson here, let me just choose there. Okay, all the questions are with do because all the questions have the subject I, you, we, they. Yes, what do I do? Where do you work? When do we have to go to meetings? How do they plan the marketing? What time do you take breakfast? All right, all the questions are with do because the subjects are I, you, we, they. But now, on these other lessons, the same information questions, but now the auxiliary is does. What does she do on Saturday and Sunday? Where does he go on Tuesdays afternoons? Which department does our boss supervise? What time does Miguel start to work? Now, the auxiliary is does because it's the third person, right? But the same order, WH word, auxiliary, subject, verb, and complement. So what does she do on Saturday and Sunday? She visits their companies and has meetings. Where does he go on Tuesdays afternoon? He goes to the company's headquarters. Which department does our boss supervise? Our boss supervises the marketing department. What does Miguel, sorry, what time does Miguel start to work? Miguel starts to work at nine o'clock. So he works in a bank too. 
Okay. <laughs> All right. I don't have anything against the people who work in a bank. I'm just clarifying this. All right. The same. Just organize these questions. Tienen que ver qué hace falta para empezar. Si solo tengo why he have a meeting. The auxiliary. The auxiliary. Necesito yeah. agregar el auxiliary. Y poner las palabras en orden. Ah, que yo veo que están bastante ordenadas, si les digo. The number one, yes. In the only house. Only the... at the auxiliary, right? Why? Yeah. That yes. we have a meeting. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Y luego podrían ser creative y agregar una answer. ¿Cuál podría ser una posible answer? Why does he have a meeting? With his he manager. He has he... a meeting because... He needs to discuss the results. He needs to show the report. He needs to review the accounts. Hay cualquier reason en válido, ¿ya? Vamos a trabajar este exercise con nuestros partners. So vamos a crear new groups. Let me check. Mm, wait a minute. New, new, new groups. Ahorita les comparto el screenshot in case you don't have the mano. Este... El das. Ajá, sería eso y ordenarla, aunque la primera. Ese llevaría el das. Ajá. Das. Guay das. Guay. Does he have a meeting? ¿Qué What opinan los demás? He has a mini. Sí, sí, ahí creo Así que sería. sería de agregarle el das. Why does, Why does he es, have a meeting? Es, he, entonces, o sea, él sería das. Él, él tendría una reunión. Sí. El, for me, Yes, he does a meeting because he speak about the report month. That's is an example. So why does he have a meeting? Okay. Thank you. Is your answer, Brian? Because he. No, because he's talk with your with her no he's talk with his así es vea eh, pero el de la auxiliary uh, uh does we, he we, we uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, because because he does uh he does no sé. He does to exercise. A meeting. ¿Cómo? Well, they have here a meeting, así quedaría. Fíjese que usando el San Google. 
si coloco why he does have a meeting, me lo coloca como una pregunta. Vamos a ver lo que usted me dice. Why, ¿qué me dijo? Why have a meeting. ¿Por qué tiene una ajá, lo mismo también? Why have sí. Bueno, vamos a dejar las cuya entonces. Why have he a meeting? ¿Por qué tiene una reunión? Sería porque Porque tiene una reunión. ¿no? Uh -huh. una reunión. Because, sería because. Uh -huh. Because, uh, permítame. Why, why does he have a meeting? Porque tiene una reunión. Uh -huh. ¿Por qué tiene una reunión? Eh, podemos ponerle because he has, he has review. Review. The new project, los mm -hmm. nuevos proyectos. Yeah. Or uh, because he has uh, Present a new project. Ah, también ajá, present en vez de revisar. He has, oops, he has, he has present the new project. Mm -hmm. Number two. ¿Dónde procesan los pagos? ¿Dónde procesa ella los pagos? Uy. Bueno, hagamos la, la que dice que qué hace Ingrid los miércoles. Ajá, ok. Sí, eso pensaba. Hacemos el paro número dos. Sí. Si you, si you send emails. Send emails. Uh -huh. Okay. Podemos ponerle otra actividad. And... And present mm. reports. The payments. Payment. Mm -hmm. In. Sí, in or, in, or, or, or on. 
payment. Payments. That's the payment. In Agricola oh, Bank. On uh -huh. Agricola Bank. In Agricola Bank. Agricola Bank. On Agricola Bank. No sé cuál se ocupa. Teacher, ¿cuál se ocupa? Yo creo que es in. In. In uh -huh. or at. Cualquiera de los dos son varios. Bye. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. In. In Agricola Bank. Uh -huh. Vaya la otra. What does Ingrid on Wednesday? ¿Qué hace Ingrid los miércoles? Ingrid. Ingrid goes does. to the cinema. Ah, entonces, go to la, the cinema. Goes to the cinema. A la promoción dos por uno. Muy correcto. To the cinema. Cinema, ¿eh? ¿Verdad? Cinema. cinema. Sí. Uh -huh. Cinema. Cinema. Vaya, la última. Ay, la última play? no la, no la escribí. La row. Última. Ese row no sé qué es. Row. Sé que está bien. Y yo también creo que está bien así. Uh -huh. fíjate, no porque... hay que cambiarle nada. Exacto, porque vaya, por ejemplo, en la número 3 dice... What does Ingrid do on Wednesday? Entonces, sí, sí, sí. No, no siento de que lleve algún cambio que se diga. Solo es, la, ajá, solo es añadirle el das o el do. ¿Qué hace Ingrid los miércoles? What does Ingrid do on Wednesday? When do you acquire... Pero yo creo que la última sí está desordenada. La última. When do? Cuando. When. Cuando. When do employ. When. Ah, no, creo que sí están bien así. Uh -huh. Es que dice algo así como empleados, adquirir es adquirir, ¿verdad? Acquire, creo. Uh -huh. Creo. Acquire. No Acquire es. Acquire, creo, creo que se dice. Acquire o acquire, no sé. Dará materia. Eh, run. Ram vi acá que era prima, es como la materia prima, eh, es como cuando, cuando adquieren los empleados la materia prima, no. Sí, sí, sí. Yo digo que puede ser que sí. Mm. Eh, está hablando del singular entonces sería do when to employ acquire mm. the raw material when employed are key teacher cuando adquiere la materia prima el empleado ¿Dónde? Hola. ¿Dónde? When, ah, when, when is cuando, ¿verdad? Cuando. Cuando, ajá. Uh -huh. sí. Cuando adquiere. What happened when employ? Uh, it's, Todos uh, los lunes. If singular. It's, if it's, sí, es singular. Uh -huh. uh, it's I, one person. Ok. When does. I should, I should do, do, right? Does. Employees, si tuvieron una S, serían los empleados. Por ahí solo hay uno. In person, say, yes, it's right? third person singular, yes. When okay, does okay. employee acquire the raw material? Uh, of, uh, well, employed, it is because it's singular, it's talk about of she or he, right? Exactly, one person. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, this does. When does employ? Okay. 
Como que lo compra al final del día, pero no queremos esa palabra. De adquirir. Ajá. Lo adquiere. De adquirir. The material at A. Quieren. Quieren de material, de raw material, la vamos a dejar. Sí. Ellos adquieren. De material L. L. De rabo. De rabo. No, hombre, ya me perdí. Ellos adquieren el material a las 8 de la mañana. Ah. Así. Sería... Ellos adquieren... Vamos a ver. The raw material at... Hey. Entonces, quieren de material, nada más. Es que raw, sí. me tra... yo busqué qué significa raw. Raw, 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 vamos a ver. Y me lo traduce como crudo. Material crudo. Mejor dejémoslo este, como que ellos adquieren de material hasta ahí. Oh, de raw, ajá. Materia ma prima, eh. Es la mm. materia prima. Ajá. Raw materials, materia prima. Vaya, entonces si le dejamos ese de raw material at AIM. AIM. Ajá, vaya. Entonces, de la 1 a la 3 nos quedó el 2. Sí. Solo en la primera la vamos a cambiar con why does he have. Why does he have, sí. Porque lo teníamos al revés. Y la otra sería where does she. Y la otra, sí. what Ingrid. Y la última, when do. Employ. Ellos. Uh -huh. Sí, así okay. sería. Uh -huh. Creo que sí. Ahí estamos. All right, time's up. You're finished, right? We're, we're good? We're finished, teacher. Nice. The first one. Why does he have a meeting? Possible answers. Because he prepared the marketing project. Because he prepares the marketing project. Mm -hmm. Any other possible answer? No more. So <laughs> I have um but let me check uh, what why does he have a meeting oh, oh, oh. 
he does uh, a meeting because talk about the report mom. He has a meeting because he needs to discuss and he needs to describe and he needs to talk about the monthly report. Okay. All right. Nice. Next. Where? Does she present? Where does, does she, she process? Process the payments. The payments. Mm -hmm. uh, she processes the payments at the Cuscatlan Bank. She processes the payments at the Cuscatlan Bank. She processes the payments at... Online? Online. Mm -hmm. On the app. Mm -hmm. She processes the payment at the at ATM. Banco Nacional de la Reforma. Mm -hmm. At the National <laughs> Bank. All right, nice. Number three. What does Ingrid? What does Ingrid? On Wednesday. Do on Wednesday. I'm sorry. On Wednesday. Mm, yeah, what does she do on Wednesday? She goes to the cinema. <laughs> <laughs> Como parte de su cuido personal en el trabajo. Of course. <laughs> Actually, Why not? The, the answer is valid. It's okay. Why not? Estamos hablando de, de funciones laborales. I don't think so. No la van a mandar al... al Sí, but no. but what if she 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 is the, she is she, a popcorn she, sales. Ah oh, yeah yeah. <laughs> but then she doesn't go for fun. She goes to work. I like it. It. I mean, the answer is valid. It's okay. So maybe she can have all the responsibilities. What does she do on Wednesday? She organizes meetings, she attends conferences, she plans agendas, she sends reports, whatever, right? If it is related to work. And if it's just hobby, free time, anything, anything goes. She does exercise, she works out, she runs, she participates wow. in karaoke, whatever you want to say. Uh -huh. And the last one, when when does the employee when does acquire the, the raw material? Employee, right? Acquire sorry. The raw material. Mm -hmm. Teacher, ¿por qué utilizamos el dos si no sabemos si es ella o, o él? O siempre. Pero se, pero se refiere a él o a ella. Es que se refiere a una tercera persona en uh -huh. singular, por ejemplo. Ah, o sea, puede ser ella o él, no hay problema. Ella o él, uh -huh, correcto. Independientemente, si es él o ella, sería das. Das. Venga. Okay. Si fuera con una S que tuviera ejemplo y si fuera en plural, ahí ya no usamos do. dos. Ahí se do. Ajá, porque estamos hablando de los empleados. Empleados. Yes. Ok, thank you. No problem. Okay, when does the employee acquire the raw material? Buy it every weekend. He buys it every week. He buys it on Sundays, on Mondays. Oh, Early Monday. A month, every Monday, uh -huh. on Tuesday. Mm -hmm. It depends. At the beginning of the month. Yes. Bueno, hasta aquí llegamos. We're done. Done, done, done. The ultimate attendance. Let me see. This thing. Present teacher. Andrea. Brian. Present. Here. Have a nice day. You too. Good night. Alexander Christian. David Escobar. Present teacher. Doris. Douglas. Good night, everyone. Good night. Stephanie, Francisco, gracias. Present. Hector. Present. Good night. <laughs> Good night. Joanna. Present. Jose, Antonio. 
Carla. Good night. Hi, Hello. Good night. Hello. Good night. Hello. All right. Good night, Miguel. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night, Nelson. Present and good night. Good night, <laughs> Ricardo. Good night, good night, person. Goodbye, see you tomorrow. <laughs> goodbye. Wendy. And Wilmer. All right, nice. Okay, see you tomorrow. Present. Have fun, enjoy, be happy, rest, go to sleep. Good night. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night.